as foreign to our American tradition. The control of the state is placed in the clenched fist of the few. The voice of the many is silent. City One is what grew up on the eastern seaboard of America from the ruins of New York and the other cities after the great atomic wars, which we projected took place or will take place in the year 2050 or thereabouts. And by Judge Dredd's time, which is the year 2100 and just afterwards, uh, the eastern seaboard has been turned into this gigantic mega city of 800 million people living in terrible, terrible conditions. The cursed earth is the radiation desert outside the city. It was so badly affected during the atomic wars that uh, ordinary people can't go and live there. It's the place where mutants live. Uh, mutants aren't allowed to live in the city, which seems very unfair to me, but that's the way that the judges are. It's a very South African situation. Uh, but for black, read mutant. If you're a mutant, you're not allowed to live in the city. You have to live outside. If you come into the city, you're liable to be shot dead with no questions asked. You have no right to be there. Uh, your presence in the city, if you're a mutant, is a crime. I think in the very first Judge Dredd story they printed, they showed uh, the Statue of Liberty, which had been removed and set up in the middle of the city. But it's totally dwarfed by the Statue of Justice, which is like a judge four or five times the size of it, looking down on liberty. And I think that that kind of symbolizes the way life is in Mega City One. Uh, the law is definitely uh, much more important than people's liberties are. I think that a lot of the things that John and I put into Judge Dredd just as a laugh or perhaps as a warning, uh, they've been overtaken by events and it sometimes makes me feel very, very uncomfortable. I don't condone anything that goes on in Mega City One. It's just that's the way that it is. I think that it's an awful place. I think that we've created a terrible place. I mean, it sometimes worries me and it sometimes frightens me that comic readers uh, and particularly kids think that it's great. And when we run surveys and ask them, what do you like about Judge Dredd? Is it his toughness or is it the, the violence? Is it the humor? They all respond, or rather 75% of them always respond that Judge Dredd is not tough enough. They want to see Judge Dredd being even more tough, even more violent, uh, which makes it kind of difficult to know exactly where to go with the character next. As we uh, created a hero who is basically a fascist, and people seem to like him and seem to want more of him. A special publication is available to accompany New Nightmares and Movie Nightmares. For your copy, send a cheque or postal order for £2, payable to Channel 4, to Nightmares, PO Box 4000, London W36XJ.